In this tutorial, you will learn how to create a bokeh effect in Photoshop. First of all, go to the File menu and create a new document. Set its width to 1900 pixels and height to 1200 pixels and click on the OK button. Now add a new layer and rename it to Bokeh Brush. Once done, disable the visibility of the background layer. Click on the Ellipse tool from the menu and draw a circle in the new layer. Decrease the fill of the Bokeh Brush layer to 50%, right-click on it and select the Blending Options from the menu. In the Blending Options window, go to the Stroke tab, increase its size to 10 pixels, change its position to Inside, and choose a black color for your stroke. Once done, click on the OK button to apply these changes. Now go to the Edit menu and click on the Define Brush Pattern option to create a new brush. Name the brush Bokeh Brush and click on the OK button to proceed. Once done, disable the brush layer. In the background layer, click on the foreground color palette, change it to gray, and use the Paint Bucket tool to paint the layer. Now add a new layer and use the Paint Bucket tool to paint the layer the same color as the background layer. Once done, rename the layer Color Layer. Right-click on this layer, choose the Blending Options from the menu, and go to the Gradient Overlay tab. Click on the Gradient Color option, divide the preset into four divisions, and select different colors for each part. It is recommended to use bright colors for your gradient. Now change the blending mode to Overlay, set the angle to 45 degrees, and click on the OK button to apply these settings. Create a new group by clicking on the New Group button and change its name to Bokeh Effect. Create a new layer in this group and rename it to Lower Part. In this layer, select the Brush tool from the menu and choose the newly created Bokeh Brush. Now we would set the dynamics of the brush in the Brush Properties panel. Go to the Brush Tip option and change its spacing to 200%. Move over to the Shape Dynamics tab and change the Size Jitter to 100% and Minimum Diameter to 50%. Click on the Scattering tab, increase the Scatter to 1000%, choose the Count to 5 and Count Jitter to 0%. Open the Other Dynamics tab and set both the Opacity and Flow Jitters to 50%. Now your Bokeh brush is ready for use. Change the foreground color to white, increase the brush diameter to 500 pixels, and randomly draw over the canvas. It is recommended to create single circles by clicking rather than dragging your cursor on the canvas. Once done, go to the Filter menu and select the Gaussian Blur option. Choose 20 pixels for the radius and click on the OK button to apply the filter. Now create a second layer and change its name to Middle Part. Change the brush diameter to 250 pixels and randomly draw all over the canvas. Go to the Filter menu and apply the Gaussian Blur using 5 pixels radius. Now simply change the blending mode of that layer, right-click on this layer and choose the Duplicate Layer option, and you're done. 